So Darren Mullen, um, you know, following on from Saturday's late defeat to Myola Park, you know, you've gone into two of the biggest, the biggest week really probably in the club's in the new club's history. I mean, how are you feeling about it? Yeah, we're going into it uh, confident. We've had a really good season, and um, you know, to finish second in our first season back in Irish League football was, you know, was an achievement in itself. But um, we want to finish. What we've, what we've started, you know, and to do that to get promoted would be terrific. Uh, we're going to end up confident, you know, we've been playing well this season, so it's something that has to be looked forward to, you know, if you, if you fear big games like this, you don't play well. So it's to go in with, with no fear and give it a really good go. Do you say, is it, is it just about sort of finishing off the season that you've had? You know, obviously you came pretty close to winning the title, but, you know, it's still in your own hands over 180 minutes. You just really sort of ask the players one final push. It is, yeah. Look, promotion by whatever it means, you know, I'll take it now. Obviously, we only have. Of one route, but that, that's that's something that that's our goal, you know, constantly until we get back into the Premiership as promotion. And to make that step back into the Championship one of the first ten would be absolutely brilliant for everyone involved at the club. It's going to be extremely difficult to harm City or or a very experienced side, you know. And to be honest, I'm surprised they're down at that at that uh, point in the league. But I'd say it's probably a 50-50 game. You know, it's whoever you're going to need a bit of luck, um, whoever takes their chances um, over the two legs. But it's it's something that we go into with. with you know, with confidence because we, we, have, we have a good team, a good squad, and um, we, we can give it a really good go. I mean, obviously, Armagh have the likes of you know, John Connolly, who everybody knows, Chad Campbell, he's obviously Premiership experience as well. You mix in with a lot of young players, but I mean, are you sort of confident in the fact that if your players play to their potential and play how they're capable of playing, that you will come out on top over the 180 minutes? Yeah, even the saying that within our own team, you know, with Mark Hughes, uh, Boiler, you know, there's a lot of people in the, in the team now that have played Premiership football, so it's, it's going to be through lack of experience, or it shouldn't be through lack of experience. It's just going to, whoever um, takes their chances, you know, who's, who's the more composed and whoever can control it, because I'm sure there'll be nerves throughout both teams. It's whoever can compose themselves and, and um, take whatever chances come their way. I can't imagine enough of that being in it, um, because um, I'd imagine the two teams are evenly matched, and it's just a case of giving ourselves a chance after. Tuesday night and, and see what uh, see what way come out and look there's two two ways of, we'll be promoted or if not we we'll know what's needed to get promoted for next season but uh, we're going to end it um, with the aim of, of pushing on and getting promotion. So what what would it mean for you know, yourself and, and the people who've worked behind the scenes as well as some of the players who've been here right from the start of of the club uh, and the supporters and you know, what would it mean to get back to you know if you could get promoted you'd be back to where the, sort of the, the previous club if you like left off I mean, what would that mean to you personally and everybody else. Absolutely brilliant. You know, way ahead of schedule um, because we give ourselves three years to, to get out of the roster, and we did that. Um, you know, in here, go in and consolidate and push on to go out in our first year would be absolutely brilliant. And it's it, you know, it's not just for me. It's not just the coach staff and the players for the fans you know, to get back. You know, people had said originally, once we get down to that level, um, we couldn't sustain ourselves, or we're probably wait and see where we are in town. And you know, we've proven that. We've been successful on the pitch, the, the committee and, and everyone involved have done great work off the pitch. So to get back up to the level where we were would be a magnificent journey for us, considering where we've come from with nothing. You know, to build a team out of nothing, um, all young you know, local lads and, and, and add to it as, as we have done would be terrific. But look, we can't get ahead of ourselves. All we can do is focus on, on Tuesday night. Um, hopefully we get a, a big crowd down, which I'm sure well, the fans have been terrific this season. And go and get a real good goal. I'd be disappointed if, if we went out with a whimper. You know, we need to go and give it a real good goal. You know, opportunities like this don't come along all the time. We don't know what's going to happen after this year. So we'll go and give it our best. And if it's good enough, well, good. If not, then we'll, we'll see what we need to, to move on.